Finally tonight here, Made in America. James Bond rode in one, Steve McQueen drove one. So does my dad. It was a big day today. April 17th, 1964, the world got its first look at the Ford Mustang. Where else but the World's Fair? After considering Cougar, Stiletto, and Allegro, the name Mustang stuck. Inspired by World War II P-51 Mustang fighter planes, 22,000 Ford Mustangs ordered that first day alone. The base price, $2,500. Wouldn't that be nice today? That same year, James Bond and Goldfinger in that race with a Mustang. Bond picked up in a Mustang in Thunderball. The speed, surprisingly, too much for Bond. You look pale, Mr. Bond. I hope I didn't frighten you. Well, you see, I've always been a nervous passenger. Some men just don't like to be driven. No, some men just don't like to be taken for a ride. Farrah Fawcett in Charlie's Angels. Look, you take the car. I'm going to stay here and check things out. Now, Mustangs made in America, sold in 150 countries. And tonight, Ford making its 10 millionth Mustang. Spelling it out with new cars. Rolling off the line in Flat Rock, Michigan. 3,500 workers helping to build them every day. We've been to Ford plants across this country. How y'all doing? Workers have shown us the parts for various makes and models made in America. The glass here, where's that from? Tennessee. The door comes from Chicago. The door panel comes from Illinois. And tonight, those Mustang makers celebrating a new milestone. It's a sweet ride. Thanks for watching here on a Wednesday night. I'm David Muir. I hope to see you right back here tomorrow from all of us here. Have a good evening. Good night.